Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here from Campit RV in Stratford, Ontario. Today I'm here to show you through the 2018 Puma 39 BHT. It's a 39 foot two bedroom park model trailer made by Palomino RV. It's got two entrances, uh, one which is a patio sliding door into the main living area, and then it's also got a rear trailer door that goes into the rear king bedroom. Uh, this one is also equipped with three power slide outs. So with this one, it is a front kitchen, so you got the three windows right at the front kitchen area, uh, which you'll see from the inside. It makes it nice and bright inside, uh, but also makes it feel nice and open. Uh, we ordered this one with the 30 pound propane tanks. So you got the hard plastic cover with the easy access tab. So with these, they just flip open. Then you can access your tanks for turning them on and off so you don't have to take the cover right off. All of our units do come with filled propane tanks uh, and they also include a full demonstration walkthrough from one of our technicians. Now we ordered one, this one with the four corner stabilizer jacks. So there's a jack on each corner that'll crank down to stabilize the trailer once you have it level. We also ordered this one with the upgraded water heater. So it's a 12 gallon gas and electric water heater. They come standard with a 10 gallon, but we upgrade them to the 12. Oh, drop the cover here. And with them, they are gas and electric, so you do have the button right down there to turn it on through electricity. Now, it does have a power awning, which we ordered on this one as well. Now, I couldn't get it all the way out, but with those power awnings, they do have the spring arms on each side, so you can have one side lower than the other if it's raining out and you want the water to trickle off. Uh, also, the Pumas, the park models do come with an onboard freshwater holding tank. So as a park model, you probably won't use that, but if you did ever move it from park to park and you needed to take water with you, you can do that. The Pumas come pre-wired for a portable solar panel. So if you were camped somewhere where you didn't have a hydro hookup, you can plug in a portable panel to keep the battery charged up. You can see at the front, you do have the porch lights as well. Uh, so it's got that overhang with the two lights right on the front. As I mentioned, it's three power slide outs and they're all on the off door side, so you don't have any on the door side. You can see you got access to exterior storage. That's underneath, underneath the U-shaped dinette that's inside, which I'll show you. So the front slide out is in the front kitchen and living area, which is sofa and dinette. The middle slide out is a middle bunk room, which you will see that from the inside. And then the rear slide out is for the king bedroom. And you do have access to storage underneath that king bed as well. Now in between the two slide outs here, you've got the outdoor shower. There's the city water hookup. The power connection, which is a 30 amp marine style detachable connection. And it's got the indicator light on the top here. So you can see when you have power, that blue LED light lights up. So that way, if you're hooking up outside and you don't have a light, you can always trace back your power and see where the issue is. Uh, also, the sewer hookups are in the middle here. Now on this one, it does have two different connections. The other one's underneath the slide, but there's one here which is for the bathroom, which is toilet and shower, and then one at the back there, or sorry, the front, which is for your kitchen sink. It was a bit muddy out here when we parked this one. That's why you can see the dirt guide on there. And then right on the back, it's got cable and satellite hookups. And then all of the Puma Park models come pre-wired for a backup camera. So if it was something that you were going to move on a regular basis, you could get the camera for the, the vehicle and then you can see what's behind you at all times. And as I mentioned, the cable and satellite hookups there. The four corner stabilizer jacks again. So you got two at the front, two at the back. And as I mentioned, it's got the two entrances. So one trailer door into the rear, which is the king bedroom. And then the patio sl glass sliding door, which is your main entrance. Now there is a porch light, and then it does have exterior power outlets, large entry assist handle beside the door for when you're going in and out, and then it does have the outdoor speakers. So you can see with that power awning, it's got LED lights built in, so nice big awning, brightens up your entire patio area. But so with these park models, a lot of the times you'll have a deck built right up to them, and then those LED lights will brighten everything up for you. Now we'll head inside. Now it does come with a uh, screen door. It's just not on just because they get installed once you put them into place permanently. Uh, so you have your screen door plus your glass sliding patio door. So right when you walk in, right to the right of the door is the control center. So this is where you'll have all of your uh, buttons for, so your exterior lights, interior lights, water heater, water pump. Also your tank monitor to tell you how full all your tanks are. 
and this has the three power slides as well as the power awning so all the buttons are centrally located right here and then you got some coat hooks right beside so you can hang up your jackets when you come in on that patio door you can see you got the blinds that'll come across to give you some shade and privacy now towards the front of the trailer is the kitchen and living area so right at the front you've got your kitchen you can see lots of counter space lots of cupboard space you got the three windows at the front you got the flush mount sink cover so when you're not using the sink you got all that extra prep space it's a high rise faucet the faucet will fold out of the way and there's a pull out sprayer on it and then the sink cover as I said it matches your countertop and then you got the nice big deep double sinks and as I mentioned all the cupboard space and then extra counter space and drawers you got the apartment size four burner stove with the oven there's a built-in microwave up above it and then extra storage space across from the kitchen is the large u-shaped dinette so you can access storage underneath those uh, seats by lifting the cushions or it had that exterior uh, compartment from the outside that you could access you can see nice and bright in here lots of windows lots of natural light all the windows are equipped with uh, the pleated shade they call it the night shade that will pull over all the interior lights are LED so they're nice and bright and they're very energy efficient we ordered this one with the living room ceiling fan and then being the park model you get the full size fridge it's an electric fridge and there is an ice maker in there as well in the freezer you can see lots of room right beside the fridge it's got a huge pantry this model is available with an optional stackable washer and dryer which is this this is where it would go if you ordered it with it you can see you got pantry storage and a great spot for your brooms vacuums extra shoes anything like that right beside the u-shaped dinette you got the tri-fold sofa so that'll pull out to uh, a good size bed two adults could sleep on it no problem you got the overhead cabinets up above and then you got your entertainment cabinet and it's, we ordered this one with the wall mounted flat screen TV and then it's got AM FM CD DVD stereo so you can see you got the sound bar and then the DVD stereo down below and again it had the indoor and the outdoor speakers the AC is ducted through the ceiling and then the heat is vented through the floor we've got the cardboard on the floor to protect the floor but you'll see the floor vents in underneath and then the flooring in this one is the tile uh, so it is a, uh, a tile look linoleum but it is all one piece as I mentioned it does have a middle bunk room so the middle bunk room has the extra slide out so you can see you've got the bunks there's a window at the top bunk the bunks are a 300 pound capacity and the top bunk will fold up and lock out of the way so if you just needed to use the bottom bunk you could leave the top bunk up and it just gives you more headroom so nobody's going to hit their head and there is some extra storage underneath the bunk too lift this up and you can see you got all extra storage down there now across from the bunk you've got extra cabinet storage and then also there's a TV hook up there as well you can see a fair amount of storage here spot to hang clothes and then extra storage up above they basically try to give you storage in every nook and cranny Once you unlock that, the bunk comes right back down. And then you got the hallway here, which there's a nice big window in the hallway. So again, lots of natural light and it does have that night shade on it to give you some privacy. The bathroom is fully enclosed on the side. So you got the toilet, which is a foot flush. And then there's storage beside, so great spot for all your linens. Lots of storage there. It's got the toilet paper holder right beside the toilet there. And then you do have the large shower with the seat and the frosted glass sliding door. And then it does have the full shower surround plus a skylight up above it. So it gives you again some more natural light plus extra headroom. And then there is a vanity which does have storage and then there's a medicine cabinet above that and a roof vent with a built-in 12-volt fantastic fan.
And then right at the back is the king bedroom. So you got the se second entrance that comes into that bedroom. So the power slide out has the king walk around bed. And then you can see you got overhead cabinet storage above it. Side table on each side. We ordered this one with the ceiling fan in the bedroom as well. There's the screen door that gets installed. And then you do have the dresser across from it with a TV hookup and then there's extra storage. So lots of storage there. There is a backer in the wall too so you can mount the TV on the wall as opposed to just setting it on the dresser. You can see you got the window right at the back. And as I mentioned the bed will lift up for storage because you do have that access from the outside as well. Gas shock arms will hold that open for you and you got lots of storage there. So again, this is the 2018 Puma 39 BHT. Now we, we have this one in stock at Camp at RV in Stratford. So my name is Jonathan Allen. Thanks for watching our video. Come on in at any time and we'd be more than happy to show you through this great uh, park model floor plan. So we always do have quite a, we have a good selection of park models and we always have more of them on order. You see we got three of the Pumas lined up together here. But you can always view our available inventory on our website, which is campoutrv.com. Or as I mentioned, stop in and see us at any time, and we'd love to show you through. Thanks again for watching the video, and have a great day.